Hello everybody, Moon360 is here with a PowerDirector 12 tutorial and in this tutorial I want to show you how to add motion to your pictures or just make static still images and photos move and mo add motion, give them motion and that sort of thing in this video. I'm going to show you how to do that. So first what you need to do is have images or image or an image that you want to add motion to. So for me, I'm just going to choose the grass that's from the built-in library. And what you want to do now, once you have the grass, the image selected, what you want to do is click on this wand. It says, once, once you hover over this, it says, use magic tools in your production. Just click on that. And then the third choice is magic motion, or you can just use the shortcut out plus two. So just click on magic motion and this is as easy as this this is magic motion it allows you to the magic motion tool incorporates zooms or pans to a still image creating a motion effect to your video clip movie clip the magic motion tool is ideal for training slideshows into engaging presentations especially with combined with magic music so this is the tool that allows you to move and pan and zoom and that sort of thing that with your static image so you can just choose the 821 already made styles as you can see I just chose the pan and zoom if we play it as you can see the picture is was a static picture that's not moving but now it's moving so this is great for slideshows instead of just having like still images just adding this motion would just make it much more interesting to watch so there's vertical down and horizontal and all that and you can also make your own as well by just clicking on user defined or uh, motion designer you can design your own so you can just if you have if you um click on the end of the this big arrow you'll you can choose the starting point and when you move the box the box uh, you can, you can uh, select the zoom and if you go over here at the front of the arrow you can uh, choose the length of the arrow and how much motion you want to give so pretty self-explanatory and I uh, this is basically how you make pictures and add motion to your pictures uh, so this is how you do it so I hope you guys enjoyed this video it's really not that hard and it's very easy to do and so subscribe for more power director 12 tips tricks and tutorials and give it a thumbs up or a like below the video player since it really helps me and share this with your friends if you find it helpful. So thank you guys for watching this video. And until next time, I'm with 360. Take care.